The Nuffield Council on Bioethics is a UK-based independent charitable body, which examines and reports on bioethical issues raised by new advances in biological and medical research. Established in 1991, the Council is funded by the Nuffield Foundation, the Medical Research Council and the Wellcome Trust. The Council has been described by the media as a leading ethics watchdog, which never shrinks from the unthinkable. Purpose The Nuffield Council on Bioethics was set up in response to concerns about the lack of a national body responsible for evaluating the ethical implications of developments in biomedicine and biotechnology. Its terms of reference are to identify and define ethical questions raised by recent developments in biological and medical research that concern, or are likely to concern, the public interest. To make arrangements for the independent examination of such questions with appropriate involvement of relevant stakeholders. To inform and engage in policy and media debates about those ethical questions and provide informed comment on emerging issues related to or derived from the Council's published or ongoing work, and to make policy recommendations to government or other relevant bodies and to disseminate its work through published reports, briefings and other appropriate outputs. How the Council works The Council selects topics to examine through a horizon scanning program, which aims to identify developments relevant to biological and medical research. Members of the Council meet quarterly to discuss and contribute to ongoing work, review recent advances in medical and biological research that raise ethical questions and choose topics for further exploration. The Council is well known for its in-depth inquiries which usually take 18 to 24 months and are overseen by an expert working group, informed by extensive consultation and research. <laughs> <laughs> Membership and governance The chair of the Nuffield Council on Bioethics is appointed by the Nuffield Foundation in consultation with the other funders. Chairs are appointed for five years. Council members are drawn from relevant fields of expertise including science, medicine, sociology, philosophy and law, for an initial period of three years, with the possibility of an additional three-year term. When vacancies arise, the Council advertises widely. The Council's Membership Advisory Group considers and makes recommendations to the Council on future members selected from the respondents to advertisements. <laughs> <laughs> Chair Professor David Archard 2017. Professor Jonathan Montgomery 2012-2017. Professor Albert Wheel FBA 2008 to 2012 Professor Sir Bob Heppel QC FBA 2003 to 2007 Professor Sir Ian Kennedy FBA 1998 to 2002 Baroness Onora O'Neill CBE FBA 1996 to 1998 Sir Patrick Nairn GCB, MC, 1991-1996. Topic. Director Hugh Whittall has been the director of the council since February 2007. Former directors Professor Sandy Thomas David Shapiro Topic. Members Current Previous members Topic. Publications 
Genome Editing and Human Reproduction, Social and Ethical Issues July 2018. Human Embryo Culture, Discussions Concerning the Statutory Time Limit for Maintaining Human Embryos in Culture in the Light of Some Recent Scientific Developments August 2017. Cosmetic Procedures, Ethical Issues June 2017. Non-invasive prenatal testing, ethical issues, March 2017. Genome editing, an ethical review, September 2016. Un natural ideas about naturalness in public and political debates about science, technology, and medicine, December 2015. Children and clinical research, ethical issues, May 2015. The Collection, Linking and Use of Data in Biomedical Research and Healthcare, Ethical Issues February 2015. The Findings of a Series of Engagement Activities Exploring the Culture of Scientific Research in the UK December 2014. Novel Neurotechnologies, Intervening in the Brain June 2013. Donor Conception, Ethical Aspects of Information Sharing April 2013. Emerging Biotechnologies, Technology, Choice and the Public Good December 2012 Novel Techniques for the Prevention of Mitochondrial DNA Disorders, An Ethical Review 2012. Human Bodies, Donation for Medicine and Research 2011. Biofuels, Ethical Issues 2011. Medical Profiling and Online Medicine, The Ethics of Personalized Healthcare in a Consumer Age 2010. Dementia, Ethical Issues 2009. Public Health, Ethical Issues 2007. The Forensic Use of Bioinformation, Ethical Issues 2007. Critical Care Decisions in Fetal and Neonatal Medicine, Ethical Issues 2006. Genetic Screening, a supplement to the 1993 report by the Nuffield Council on Bioethics 2006. The Ethics of Research Involving Animals 2005. The Ethics of Research Related to Healthcare in Developing Countries, a follow-up discussion paper 2005. The Use of Genetically Modified Crops in Developing Countries, a follow-up discussion paper 2003. Pharmacogenetics, Ethical Issues 2003. Genetics and Human Behavior, The Ethical Context 2002. The Ethics of Patenting DNA, a Discussion Paper 2002. The Ethics of Research Related to Healthcare in Developing Countries 2002. Stem Cell Therapy, The Ethical Issues, a Discussion Paper 2000. The Ethics of Clinical Research in Developing Countries, a Discussion Paper 1999. Genetically Modified Crops, The Ethical and Social Issues 1999. Mental Disorders and Genetics, The Ethical Context 1998. Animal to Human Transplants, The Ethics of Xenotransplantation 1996. Human Tissue, Ethical and Legal Issues 1995. Genetic Screening, Ethical Issues 1993. Influence The Council's recommendations to policy makers have often been described as influential. Topic. Funding The Council was entirely funded by the Nuffield Foundation from 1991 to 1994. Since 1994, the Council has been jointly funded by the Nuffield Foundation, the Medical Research Council and the Wellcome Trust on a five-year rolling system. Towards the end of each five-year period, a process of external review is a condition of continued support. Funding has been confirmed until 2022 following the satisfactory completion of the latest funding bid. Topic. 
ethical approach The Council takes the view that its terms of reference do not require it to adopt the same ethical framework or set of principles in all reports. The Council is therefore not bound by the values of particular schools of philosophy for example, utilitarianism, deontology, virtue ethics or approaches in bioethics, such as the four principles of bioethics autonomy, justice, beneficence, non-maleficence, or the Barcelona principles autonomy, dignity, integrity, vulnerability. In 2006-7, John Harris, professor of bioethics at the University of of Manchester, and Dr. Sarah Chan carried out an external review of the way ethical frameworks, principles, norms and guiding concepts feature in the Council's publications. The authors found that the ethical frameworks used in the Council's publications had become increasingly explicit and transparent. 